Good morning, friends. It's 10 o'clock in the morning. I look fab. So fab. Freaking fabulous. Let me go wash up real quick and then I can give you the deets on what we're doing today. Today on the agenda, we are... <clears throat> where's my hair tie? We have to go to the Asian market to get some water spinach because we are filming a ramen mukbang. And I want to show you guys how I eat my ramen. We're doing a vegan style ramen because I just... I discovered it a few months ago and I absolutely love it way more than the other ramens I've been eating. And I love eating my ramens with a lot of veggies. So I wanna show you guys. That's what we're doing later today. But first, we're gonna look a little bit presentable. So let me brush my teeth and do my hair and a little bit of Mirko. Mirko. A lot of people on Instagram always ask me how I get like my perfect looking bun. And, and it's, be oh hi. And it's because I use these donut thingies. You can get these at Forever 21 right by the cash register for literally like three, four dollars maybe. And if you don't want to use money, go get a sock that matches your hair color. Cut the end that is closed. So then you have two open ends and then roll it up into a donut and that works perfectly fine. easy and then you want to bobby pin it down and these donut things come in different sizes so this is i think the biggest size i've ever seen and they have smaller ones too i think i left them at carlos's house and that's what i use to do my space buns i'll just do i'll just use like the two small ones on both sides and there you go super easy and put together now, one of the advice that I would give you if you are doing this hairstyle is um, it's really hard to do it with straight hair. So just make sure that you curl your hair a little bit so it has a little bit of movement so it grips around the donut more easily. I've done this with straight hair and let me just tell you, the hairs are so straight, they just go everywhere. So make sure you have a little bit of a curl. Uh, but other than that, that's it. And then a little bit of hairspray, you're good to go. I'm not too sure if you guys remember or not, but in a few vlogs back, I believe it was the one where I was surprising Carlos for his birthday, I received the LOL mattresses in the mail and I was so excited. The FedEx guy literally came with like these three huge boxes. I'll show you guys in a little bit how the boxes look like and what's on the inside and what the process is like. But I've been sleeping on this LOL mattress for I think exactly two weeks today. Um, I'm pretty sure because I think we unboxed it and everything on Mother's Day and that was exactly two weeks ago so I feel like this is a really good time to give you my first feedback I will continue sleeping on it and giving you my feedback every so often in other vlogs but I've partnered up with Lil Mattress to sleep on their mattress and give you my feedback on it and kind of give you the process of everything and what I think of it so when this opportunity was given to me I was really excited because as you guys know Carlos and I are thinking about moving out and so one of the things that we really wanted to invest in was a really good mattress and we've always wanted a foam style mattress but you know those things can range for over a thousand two thousand dollars they are quite quite expensive but these mattresses are under a thousand i believe i believe right now the queen size one which is the one that i have is for 750 dollars and honestly sleeping on it for two weeks the quality is so so good it really curves to your body which is something that i love it just feels like you're sleeping on marshmallows like on a cloud i love it so far and i love that it's not too thick and too like bulky it really fits into my room perfectly and th I think one of my favorite things is the unboxing process so I'll show you guys in a little bit what the boxes look like because they're downstairs um, because hopefully we're getting ready to move next week but I haven't really talked about it because we're still waiting for approval but um it comes in this box and the coolest thing about it is when I saw the box I was like how can a mattress possibly fit into this box? So what they do is they put it into this plastic wrap 
which protects the mattress extremely. So during shipping, nothing's gonna happen to it. They suck all the air out, so the mattress becomes super flat and skinny. And then you roll that plastic bag onto your spring box or wherever you want the bed to be. You cut the plastic open and all the air comes out and that's when the foam expands and becomes your bed. It was literally the easiest process in the whole entire world. The only thing is you just had to carry that box up the stairs or to your bedroom, wherever you want the bed to be. And it wasn't even that heavy, which was so good. But sleep wise, I absolutely love it. I think it's extremely comfortable, a really good investment for the price. Like I said, these beds can be so expensive. So when you find something that works, exactly like an expensive bed but such an affordable price it's such a good deal and i believe i saw on their website you can try it out for a hundred days free and if you don't like it you can just send it back to them but i would double check on the website um i think the website has everything that you guys need to know and if you're interested in a king one i believe it's still under a thousand dollars it's in the 800 category which is so so good because king size foam beds are so freaking expensive you guys so as you guys know i don't have a bed frame because my old one broke and i wasn't going to invest in one until i move out but this is a spring box and then this is my old mattress and then we just put the low mattress on top as you guys can see here that is the low logo and the top is i love the bottom it has like this protected sheet over it and then the top is the foam material the top is really cooling so if you uh, get really hot at night, the top part is so cooling and it feels really, really comfortable and nice. But this is about how thick it is if you want to get an estimate. I absolutely love it. Um, if you don't have a mattress, you can just put this on a spring box. It works perfectly fine. But this was like the most convenient way for now before I move out. But oh my god, I love this baby so much. Also, something else that I love is that when we were unboxing it, it doesn't smell um, I ha I bought like um, a foam cover top thing where you just kind of lay it on top of your bed ones and that thing smelled so freaking bad. I had to air it out for like five days before I could actually sleep on it. So that was one of my favorite things. Let me run downstairs and show you guys the box real quick so you can have an idea of what it's like when you guys order it and it comes to your house. Sorry, there's like so much stuff going on in our living room because we are doing a bunch of little projects. But this is what the low mattress looks like when it comes to your house it literally sits in this box and it's just gonna sit in the front of your house when they deliver there's also tracking so you know exactly when it comes um, but this is what it looks like this is the queen size and then over here is the king size bed oh my gosh what is going on hi hi sweetie what you got stuck with balloons here let's talk about the little mattress that you're also really obsessed with but this is what the box looks like, and then um, on the inside, it's just the bed rolled up. Why are you crying? <laughs> ah! We're gonna show our friends what the inside of this looks like. Okay. So this right here is what the inside looks like. That is the mattress basically sucked down really skinny into the plastic bag and rolled up. It's super neat. Basically all you have to do is take that out, put it on the surface that you guys want it, unroll it, cut the plastic, and then the foam bed is going to expand. Super easy and simple, one of my favorite things. So I will have the link to their website down below in case you guys are interested. I know this is the season that uh, students are kind of looking for apartments, moving in, moving out, whatever it may be. So I will post the... <laughs> Why do you look so mesmerized? I will post a link down below for you guys to check out uh, Lil Mattresses. It's so good. So good. So good. Put a little bit of makeup on. It's kind of chilly outside today. I've been so dry lately. I've also been extremely stressed out the last, I would say, five days or so. Um, I don't really want to talk about it too much. Just um, a few personal things and yeah but i'm okay i should be okay but this past week has been really rough so that explains the lack of videos last week i really just needed my attention needed to be on other things 
But you know what? Every day is a new chance to make your life positive. So even when you fall down sometimes, pick yourself back up. I've been trying this Kiehl's lip balm number one thing. It's okay. It's not like mind-blowing, but you know I have really dry lips, so I'll do anything. I'll try anything. I think we're just gonna put some foundation on and call it a day. I just wanna look a little bit put together. I'm letting my eyebrows grow out, so I'm not grooming them right now. The Fenty Primer is my best friend. I love it. Oh my gosh, like I am obsessed with it. So you guys know how I lost all of my footage from graduation. Well, in that memory card was also the footage of Carlos and I unboxing the LOL mattress. So that's why I was really disappointed because it was really exciting. Like. We were jumping on the bed and stuff, so. But um, yeah, I didn't want to unbox it again. I'm probably gonna unbox and show you guys the actual unboxing process when I actually move. But that's something that has been stressing me out so much is we're waiting right now to hear if we got approved or not. Um, and we're not gonna find out until Tuesday. And today is Sunday, so. And I'm not a patient person, so. It's just giving me a lot of anxious energy and I don't like being anxious because I overthink, so. But everything happens in life for a reason, so. I'm just trying to stay positive. I have little bumps right here, I don't know why. On days that I just wanna do a little bit of coverage and something light, I just go in with my Giorgio Armani foundation. My ride or die, I love this thing so much. I have been loving this eyebrow um, tint. This is the CoverGirl Easy Breezy Brow Shape and Define. This has been my current favorite eyebrow product. It's so good. It gives you that bushy hair effect, which I can never seem to get with anything else. I think I used this in my one of my tutorials. Oh, but it's so good, you guys, I love it. Let's use some blush. This is the Neutrogena blush. Oh, my favorite. Uh, number 20. I love Neutrogena's blushes. I feel like the Neutrogena line does not get a lot of love. <laughs> like, truthful, like, honestly, I just feel like it does not get a lot of love. And we look the same, but a little bit better. I also want to show you guys, I got a new lens. This is the 18-35mm f1.8. So good if you're looking for a lens that blurs your background so good i used this in a makeup tutorial the other day and it looked amazing this is what happens when i film a makeup tutorial i did a sponsored makeup tutorial with neutrogena trying out their hydro boost line so you guys have to watch that because the foundation is freaking bomb and the concealers like these are their concealers so good like so good and i tried the aspen palette which was amazing too if any of my subscribers live in orange county this is the vietnamese supermarket that i go to to get most of my ramen but also basically any other like exotic things uh this is my favorite vietnamese supermarket in orange county i love it today didn't go as planned i was gonna do ramen but i think i'm gonna do that another time and make it vegan but today we are doing giant prawns which i've never m boiled myself before and the shrimp that i usually get for seafood boils aren't as big so our the prawns i'm about to show you right now are huge i got giant Enormous ones and then I got like smaller bigger ones if that makes sense so let me show you guys and basically today is kind of like a homemade seafood boil so these are the prawns that I got so these are like the smaller ones You look so pretty. <gasps> oh, well, there goes my hard work. I have to push this stick up their camera. I want to show my friends my dress. Look at that. So this is her dress. It's really colorful. I wanted to show you guys my dress. Look at it, blow in the wind. Isn't it pretty? Actually, it really is pretty. Yeah. Okay, let's go home. 
Carlos is watching the Celtics play right now. Apparently, this is the last game before the final, so very exciting. He's over there. Um, I am watching my friend Aspen's video. She uploaded a tutorial, so I'm going to watch that. And then I'm editing the pictures that we took for Fashion Nova just now. Hi, hi, hi. We're watching YouTube videos. It's halftime. How are the Celtics doing? They're up by four. That's good. No, they need to be up by like 20. Be so fine. I can feel comfortable. Can I get an OOTD? Let's show our friends what you're wearing. Go bán gì vậy? Cho bạn coi. Cho bạn coi con đang bán gì. Hmm? Lớn mắt kiến. Lớn mắt kiến. Lấy lên. Lấm lắm. Lấm lắm. No, được rồi. Lật lấy. Ay. Ay. Hey. Say hi to the camera. Hello. <laughs> Let's go find some ducks you can see. She has a little syrup bottle. <laughs> I don't know why she likes it. <laughs> Yesterday was ketchup and today is syrup. Really? Yeah. Come on, baby. I love her overalls, they're so cute. Yay, she's gonna feed the ducks. Hopefully she's not scared of them. There's like a few ducks here though. It's not like, Kim said that there are usually more ducks, but I guess there's not that many today. What is that? It's rice. Oh. You shouldn't feed them bread. Why? A lot of people feed them bread. Well, why shouldn't you? It doesn't work well in their body, I guess. Uh oh. There they come! <laughs> Are you happy? Yeah? Here. You gotta throw it, okay? Don't pay you guys. Pay you now. Pay you on. Pay them. Sit here for a minute. And she's gonna give you some water. Hey, one more. One more, one more. Look at her hat. <laughs> it's sunny outside. Just enjoying the view. We have this cute little mini park. Hey, did you see that? Um... Hey, you having fun, baby? Yeah? She's so cute. Ooh. Did you guys have fun? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Say hi. <laughs> Mwah. Bye, friends. You guys are so cute. <laughs> Going home. Going home. Carlos is putting Kim Sung back in her car seat. And then we are going to head home. It is pretty sunny outside, you guys, so that's enough sun for the day. We're out here for a while. This is yours. Are you safe? Yeah? We are home and she fell asleep. Oh baby. Oh. Uncle Carlos is gonna take her inside. Okay friends, what a day it's been. So sorry that I haven't gotten a chance to get as much footage as I want. This vlog was probably one of the super chill ones. There um, are just a lot of things going on in my life right now. Um, so I'm just trying to get this week over with and get a positive mindset back. So other than that, we will be back on track, I'm sure. I'm sure we will. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching my video. Leave a comment down below. Love to hear from you guys. Subscribe if you haven't already and give this video a thumbs up. I love, love you guys. I'll see you in my next one. Bye, my loves.